The menu bar just above the toolbar displays the commands that perform most of the operations that Spaces provides. You will become well acquainted with these commands as you spend time with this course. Whenever you click on particular command, a series of options appears below and you will select the one that most fits your particular need. The commands are now listed and briefly described. This is the file. The file deals with, with different functions associated with files including opening, reading, as well as exiting SPSS. Edit. A number of editing functions including copying, pasting, finding and replacing are available. View several options that affect the way the screen appears the option most frequently used is value labels which is here data operations related to defining configuring and entering data also deals with the storing cases merging or aggregating files and selecting or waiting cases transform Transformation of previously entered data including recording, computing, new variables, recording and dealing with missing values. Analyze. All forms of data analysis begin with a click of the analyze command. And then graphs. Creation of graphs or charts can begin either with a click on the graphs command or often as an option while other statistics are being performed. Utilities Utilities basically deals largely with fairly sophisticated ways of making complex data operations easier. Most of these commands are for advanced user and will not be described in this course. And then extension, add-ons or extensions. This is extension hub. You can download the extension uh, from the Git, GitHub or SPSS format. And then the window deals with the position, status and format of, op of open windows. This menu may be used instead of the taskbar to change between SPSS windows like minimum all windows, go to the designated view window or demo or, or you can, s you can uh, toggle from a demo to output and untitle and other um, files and that is in the last help uh, which is truly useful ad with search capabilities tutorials and the statistic coach that can help you to decide what types of species procedure to use to analyze your data